Right guys, so I decided to play a different game because, you know, I'm pretty fucking bored, but I mean, I've been having problems. Uh I tried to upload a COD Mobile video like yesterday. And it worked, but the fucking quality. The quality was shit. It was recording it was recording fucking wrong. Um, you know, it wasn't recording. It was gay. I'm gonna try it again. And I gotta fucking find this problem because the quality was absolute shit. It didn't... I don't know why it can't work with me anymore. But as you can see, I chose to play a different game. I'm playing Dead Space Mobile. I recently got this game. I got it yesterday. I played it. Um, beat it on easy. Now I'm gonna try it on normal. Um, probably gonna go for the first two chapters and I'll end the video. Um, yeah, it's a pretty good game. Pretty good game. Wish I could record with audio, but sadly this doesn't work with internal audio because gay. Um, because Android is gay sometimes, but you know what? We'll work. We'll work past it. You'll probably see me struggle. Um, just because of the fact that, uh... The controls in this game are odd. We'll say that. You know, they aren't the best optimized. They're just kind of eh. If you can, I'd suggest picking it up. I got it. It was an adventure to try and get it. You know, it is, yeah. If you have any games that you want me to play, suggest them in the comments, since I'm pretty sure comments are working now. They weren't working for a little bit, unlike one video. The easy mode was, as expected, easy. So, I want to see how it is on normal. I'll probably progress to hard. I'm not 100% sure if this game has an impossible mode like other Dead Space games. It's been a while since I played a Dead Space game. You know, besides this, stop turning when I don't want you to. What the fuck? There we go. Again, controls sometimes. You know, sometimes they just don't, you know. I wish there was a different control, kind of, uh, control, uh, what the fuck, it, however you call it. <laughs> Whatever you call it, I wish there was a different, um, option. Like custom and stuff. Because... <laughs> Then again, this game did release alongside Dead Space 2, which was in like 2010-11 area somewhere. So in all honesty, this was back when mobile games were kind of, you know, they weren't very mainstream. Now they are a bit more mainstream. But, you know. This is a very interesting game. I'd give it a 7 out of 10. I wish there were more mobile games. I think there was Dead Space Extraction, but I'm pretty sure that wasn't mobile. It was a spin-off though. Yeah, I haven't played a Dead Space game in forever. 
I'd suggest picking them up if you can, just sometime. Um, you know, whenever you pick them up. Um, Dead Space, Dead Space 2, Dead Space 3, uh, or 4. 360, PS3, and PC. But I'm pretty sure they're all backwards compatible. So you got an Xbox One. You shouldn't have too much trouble. And boom, that is chapter one done. Now entering government sector exit wounds. Gotta retrieve the stasis module. This is obviously where the game really starts to kick off. The game takes place um, concurrent with Dead Space 2. Um, as you know, well, you probably don't know if you haven't played Dead Space 2, but in Dead Space 2, Isaac kind of wakes up right after, not right after, but, you know, a little bit after Dead Space um, 1. And, um, you know, there's necromorphs. <laughs> um, it's not like a slow burn. No, you're put right into the action. Necromorphs exist now. Damn. Fucked him up good. Um, yeah, necromorphs kind of just exist right then and there. Um, you don't slowly discover them. You know, which makes sense. Um, Dead Space 2 was more action than Dead Space 1 was, but even then, that doesn't mean horror wasn't completely non-existent in Dead Space 2. It was still very scary, unlike Dead Space 3. Dead Space 3 had a couple moments. I feel like Stasis is very gimmicky in this game. Um, at first, you know, I'm, I'm really trying to do, you know, get as much as I can out of this playthrough. Just because, you know, it's a higher difficulty. What the fuck? This is kind of what I meant by control being eh. I swear to god. I swear to god. Yeah, it does this a couple times. This does get pretty old. Alright, try to conserve resources. Whoa. Bitch, get off me. I'll probably do three chapters. Because I'm feeling it. I might actually do a full-on review of this game. I tried to, it just didn't turn out the way I wanted, and it was very long. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't know, I try to keep my videos a bit shorter. Oh, fuck, yeah, probably should get some ammo. 
I want to keep my videos on the shorter side, but just type in the comments if you want longer videos. I can always try and do that. I don't think it would be too much of an issue, just longer upload times. But it wouldn't be completely impossible. You're the bad boy, I don't like you. So yeah, I'll probably do three chapters instead. Hell, I'll do a full-on Dead Space uh, mobile walkthrough, guys. I'll fucking do it. I'm not really trying to do a speed run, but, you know, hell, it'd be nice. Speed run is under two hours for this game. You'll get an achievement for doing it. This is a trippy room. It's when you're, uh... Look, see, there weren't bodies. Now there are. It's a very fucking trippy room. It's when you're, um... I don't know what they're called. Um, I guess you're kind of... Hallucinations. There. Yeah. Um, hallucinations kind of come into play. Yeah, it's trippy as fuck. It's where the horror aspects start to melt in, even though this game isn't all that scary. It is pretty creepy sometimes. I gotta admit... But these don't really get you. It got me the first two times it did this, but... Mm. Yeah, see? It's trippy. Little fucking leaper. I believe that's what they're called. It's been a while. I could stomp on him and not miss. Thank you. Dismemberment really doesn't play that big of a part in this game. You know, you can kill them just as easily with um, headshots and body shots. Which is probably to compensate for the controls. I wouldn't be surprised. I think this is also like the first Dead Space game to have an ammo limit. I don't like it. Let you max off plasma cutter ammo pretty early on, but it actually does start to get pretty um, rare later on in the game. You know, to just increase the difficulty. That's pretty cool, I guess. I feel like the beginning probably could have been done better, just to really nail, you know, hit it home that you are pretty much helpless. No loading time whatsoever. Government sector underbelly. I don't know what the fuck that was. Have to unlock the administration area. If you're not following the story, I'm sorry. I have subtitles on, but obviously I can't do much for the audio. You can look up a story synopsis if you're really that interested, but you know it's not anything. It's not anything blockbusting. Groundbreaking, you know, it, it really isn't. It's serviceable, though. It isn't terrible. I 
Damn. Hallucinations. Ah, damn. Look at that health go down. That is brutal. Um... <laughs> So pretty much easy mode is the way dead space is meant to be played. Oh, Jesus Christ, look at that health go down. Yeah, it's been a while since I played a dead space game, so I feel like playing it on easy. You know, coupled with the fact that it is a mobile game and I wasn't expecting much out of the controls. Damn, that is... Fuck you. Um, that is... Spooky. That damage increase, though, that's not fun at all. Long hallways makes you feel claustrophobic. Good Dead Space feel. Something Dead Space 3 failed to do. Again, Dead Space 3 wasn't that horror y. Alright, I feel like I just went backwards. I went backwards. Oh. Yeah, there are a lot of trippy moments in this. Oh. There are a lot of trippy moments in this game. More so than any other Dead Space game, actually. Some Dead Space games did have pretty trippy moments, but this has arguably the most. Fuck the, fuck the Ripper. I'm going with the plasma cutter. My trusty plasma cutter. You can never go wrong. Also, at this point, the ammo is still the most common, so... I can use it indiscriminately. Why do you need credits? Well, you see, boy, that's integrated into the, um, you know, store. I think this was the first Dead Space game to, uh, have. Why is there a beam of light? Yeah, a lot of visual glitches in this game. I should have dismembered you. What the fuck are you doing? Asshole. Fuck you. <laughs> oh damn. Oh damn. Yeah, honestly, I feel like dismemberment. I try to play it like it is a classic Dead Space game, but I can't because dismemberment is just so utterly useless. Unless you dismember the head, but even then, extra steps, whatever, make it simple, shoot him in the fucking body. It was not like that in pretty much any other Dead Space game. I hate Dead Space Extraction, it's a bit different. I haven't played it though. I do not like this part. It's just a lot of these parts drag on for way too long. 
And I'm actually concerned about the difficulty, since it is normal. I want to get this stuff first. If I could open the door. Again, controls. If you could not exist for five seconds, that'd be great. Ooh, he glitched. Is there anybody else in here? No, because I don't want to get stuck. I don't want you to exist. That's why I have this plasma cutter. You need to die. If you don't die, I'm going to call the authorities. Would you want that? You don't want to go to jail at such a young age. Cool again. Is that it? No. <laughs> if that was it, then I'd be going out. But, that, but I'm not going out yet, so... I want it to be- oh. You are a lanky man. I don't like you. You can fuck off now. Tall lanky son of a bitch. Where am I supposed to be- oh. That man has seen better days. These people have seen better days. You're not gonna come out? You are. I know you are. Yep. Slice him. Thank you. You can stun lock them to hell. It's actually funny. Nigga, what? No, get off of me. Die. I was not expecting that. That's cheating. I just punted a baby. That's funny. If it's an undead baby, it's okay. Alright, this is the end of our little adventure here. Might as well buy some shit. No, upgrade. Uh, upgrade the damage with the plasma cutter. Yes. Great capacity. I'm just pretty much gonna max out my fucking plasma cutter considering that's what I'm probably going to be using for most of this. I fully maxed out my well, I don't think I fully maxed it out, but I mostly I almost maxed out my plasma cutter in my easy playthrough, so that's what I'm going with this time too, because fuck everything else. It sucks. The heavy pulse rifle isn't even in the game. That pisses me off. It's only it's in the game, but not in the Android version, which is what I'm using. <laughs> nah, I'll buy a power node. Get one step closer to maxing out my plasma cutter. It's always fun. We get on the tram. I, these tram sequences, it's pretty much a review of what we learned in this chapter or group of chapters. What did we learn? Okay, we learned that we should kill all assholes. <laughs> kill all assholes. There we go. That's what this game is. Kill all assholes. And collect their shit. I'm oh, moving close to use my plasma. Oh, yeah, see? See, it, it is. It's exactly that. It's a review of what we learned here. What did we learn? Again... Cut them apart. What well, you should be dead. According to this game, you should be dead. You are gone. <laughs> 
shoot off their cocks. Can we go now? I think we can go now. No, we cannot go now. Hey, they're, they're still an asshole. This, that's why this facility has an asshole detection meter. It has an asshole detection system. It can know how many assholes there are and how many we need to eliminate before we can go. No. <clears throat> Saw. I'm going to hurt you. You know, the mines. This is a very creepy part, actually. The mines are pretty fucking creepy, I'm not gonna lie. Everything else is just claustrophobic, which I can deal with, but I can't deal with the mines. Alright, I'm gonna buy stuff. Oh, identity crisis. Um, but I'm gonna buy stuff. Nah, no, I'll buy stuff later. And um, that's pretty much where we're gonna leave this video off for now. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, do whatever the fuck. You are good people. Um, see ya.